Hi guys, welcome to what's in my bathroom and my makeup routine in the morning. I actually already have my makeup done, but in a different episode I was going to do like a one-on-one -on, -one on how I do my makeup. Okay, so first of all, my favorite thing is lipstick. I don't think I wear it enough, but MAC is like my go-to for everything. Um, they have all the colors, like every color of the rainbow. And so I was going to go over some of them that I have that are some of my favorites. Actually, I don't wear red that much. I'm kind of like, I wear peachy nude colors, like a lot, a lot of the time. The only problem with those is they kind of like build up around like the side of your mouth a little bit. I don't know, not my favorite, but first of all, I have this all organized by eyes, my lips, and then I have my more eye stuff, super important. <laughs> and then I have like my facial stuff, so I have powder, bronzer, um, or a blush, and then I have my birch box saves in the bottom drawer because I never get to go through them all. And I thought maybe I would do like what comes in my birch box every month versus Ipsy because I think personally, I don't know, I think they're both great, but I, I love birch box. I love the boxes that they come in, and if I used Ipsy all the time, I would have like a million bags. So, yeah. Okay, so the first thing that I use is Lancome um, Foundation. It is the best. This color is 110 Ivy. So if you're fair skinned, this would be the um, one to get for you. And then I also mix it with Neutrogena. So I know that sounds crazy, but the Neutrogena is like super high coverage. So I use that like underneath, and then I will put that on top. Next I have, I just got this yesterday, so I don't know what this is. Generally I don't buy drugstore makeup products ever. So this is new for me, but this was like a, a foundation stick. Actually I'm using it as an under eye concealer. So far I really like it actually. I like the travel bottles because I feel like makeup goes bad <laughs> after a little while. So I don't like to keep them in big bottles if they're just going to sit there. Um, and I'm not going to use them because I'm kind of more of a natural skin person. I like my stuff to look natural and feel natural and not like I'm wearing a ton of makeup. Um, next is like my drawer of all of my lip stuff. And generally speaking, I don't wear half the stuff that's in here unless I'm like going out. So, but this stuff is called Lip Conditioner and it's from MAC and I use it all the time. I have these all over. They're in my purse, they're in my bedroom, in here. Like no matter where I am, one of those is with me. Um, the rest of this is just kind of uh, lipsticks and stuff like that. I do have a MAC lip pencil. I'm kind of obsessed with MAC. I feel like they make a really good product. But for foundation purposes and um, skin care, I always go with Lancome. They are my favorite. Next, I use, this is my next drugstore product. It is the one thing that I will buy from a drugstore no matter what because it's amazing. This stuff works so good. This is the Rimmel Stay Matte. And I think the shade is, this is also 110. So I must be an ivory color, but um, Stay Matte. It's like four bucks, so worth it. Um, I use a MAC bronzer. This one is, don't you love how the little sticker just goes away? I don't know if that's a number or if it's just called MAC bronze. Anyways, the number is D95. In case you work at MAC or you, you would know, D95. I have this blush from MAC. It's really pretty, needs like none. For it, but my favorite, favorite blush is the one from Benefit. Benefit makes amazing products, and this one is called Rush of Heat. So, I guess you could say kind of a hot color. I have my MAC Finish like shimmer for your cheeks. It's really pretty. I don't know if you can see that, but. Um, this one's called Soft and Gentle A75, and it's basically just a mineralizer, so it looks gorgeous when you put it on. People ask me all the time, why are your cheeks like, how do you get your cheeks to look like that? And then here's my amazing drawer of little samples from my birch box. I used a couple, I just haven't gotten to all of them yet. I even got Smashbox in my last one, so that's really cool. So 
that's what I do for um, my makeup. Um, I actually did kind of a no-no and I bought some brushes from Amazon. They were, I think, five bucks and you got like 50 brushes. Um, they lasted like a week and there's a couple that I still use and it's all these baby brushes right here. They're, they're little but they work good. I have a couple brushes from Target. This is one. And then this one is the Urban Decay brush and I use it for everything. I use a beauty blender sometimes. I haven't quite figured those out yet. If you have any information on that, let me know because I'd love to know how to use it. I don't know how to use it. I think you're supposed to get them wet. I should probably YouTube it and figure it out. Um, as for doing my hair, this is the Moroccan oil that you would like put in your hair. It's a treatment. It's like a leave-in treatment. Oh my god, I swear by this stuff. It works so good and I use it on a daily, which is why I have the big bottle. The big bottle though is a little pricey. It's about 40 bucks for that and I mean I guess if you use it all the time that's not bad. And you only need a tiny bit in like the palm of your hand, rub it together and then put it through your hair. Um, I actually have a favorite brush. Let me see here. This one came from, it's called the Gripper Brush. You can find it on Amazon. And I think there is a number that came, oh yeah, the number is 922. So if you look this up, this is the best round brush you will ever buy. I literally just blow dry my hair. I do this three times a week. I try and not overdo it because the heat will destroy your hair. And I obviously have my ends like pretty bright. I have an ombre, so I try to not wear out my hair too much. Um, but for the most part, that's like what I do in the morning. So I think that's all for this video, and I will post one on my step-by-step -step on how I do my makeup. I will see you then. Don't forget to subscribe. I can't wait to see you guys again. Bye.